In this video, I'll introduce you to a file optimizer that will help you to meet specific size requirements or to save storage space through batch file optimization. This tool can handle over 150 file extensions, including images, videos, audio files, PDFs, and more without quality loss. I've been personally using this tool to bring my thumbnails down the 2 megabyte size limit and it always helps me in those situations. First, I'll share tricks for meeting specific size requirements and then I'll show you how you should approach saving storage space by batch optimizing files. After we download and install file optimizer using the link in the description you can import the file you want to optimize by right clicking inside of file optimizer and clicking add files or you can drag and drop your file from file explorer to file optimizer this file is over the 2 megabyte size limit and i'll be using file optimizer so i can use this image as a thumbnail in youtube you can start the optimization by right clicking and selecting optimize all files or by clicking ctrl plus o you can watch the optimized size and when the file goes under 2 megabytes i can stop it and the optimization will still be applied you can see in file explorer the image is now 1.73 megabytes and now i can upload it to youtube if the size requirement is still not met you can right click go to options and look for the file extensions in this bar in my case it's png and you can allow lossy optimizations which will get higher files reduction at the cost of some quality loss and then you can try again you can see it's already a lot smaller the final file size is 700 megabytes with lossy optimizations and we've saved one and a half megabyte if the file you optimized becomes corrupted or has undesirable changes you can recover it from the recycle bin by right clicking on the original file and clicking restore for batch optimizations i recommend choosing a time where you won't be working on your computer because it might take a while to optimize a large number of files you can import all files inside a folder to file optimizer by right clicking and selecting add folder be warned that in my experience that mov files almost always get corrupted you can tell whether a file got corrupted when doing batch optimization if there is a huge difference between the original size and the optimized size and if a lot of files have the exact same optimized size if you double click on these files you'll find that they will not play back properly to restore the original files open the recycle bin right click on the corrupted files and select restore 